What's up everybody? I'm Brian from I1 Tesla and today we're turning this into this. So I was editing this video and I realized I didn't explain why I did this. As you may know, I like to take things apart and come up with new ideas that not too many people are doing. Well, I saw this idea from this other YouTuber uh, and race car driver, Brad DeBerti. He made an AR-15 version of this and uh, AR-15 pressure washer. And I thought that was really cool and I got to thinking, well, Tesla made an, an airsoft rifle into a flamethrower and that's not really practical you can't really use that but this thing you can really use so i found the same gun and modeled it off of not a flamethrower so uh got my logo on there the the trigger works really good i ended up having to if you end up building this this is actually bent so this comes out straight down the handle because you don't want it to stick out the back like i've seen some people remake the ar-15s uh, pressure washers so just something to think about if you're going to do this i'm sure not too many people are going to do this but it's not cheap the ar-15 version i think he sells for 700 dollars. so i guess if you want me to make one 700 bucks i'll make you one I don't know how useful it's going to be how many times i'm going to use it but this thing is amazing i'm glad i made it it's one of one so far and uh there we go that's a good thumbnail right there that's a good thumbnail right there. So I gotta say this thing worked perfectly. I got a foam cannon on top. I used the foam cannon in front of this thing. I have a 3.0 nozzle on the front, so it really backs the pressure way down. I this is so much so this is so cool. Most Tesla people don't have actually I don't think anybody has made one of these. People have made an AR-15 version of this before, but I put it on the Brian Company. This is just paper right now. I'm gonna get a sticker cut for this and uh, or maybe 3D print some plastic that's raised on both sides. I think that'd be cool. Maybe even drop this, this thing, this part drops down, maybe uh, store the tips in here. But uh, this thing came out amazing. Uh, the stock is still adjustable. I have the hose coming right out the back. I've seen other people online cut the back of this open and it's just not good. This thing turned out better than I thought. Uh, it's really cool. Hopefully YouTube doesn't demonetize this because this is a gun, although it's a pressure washer. It's not a gun, this is not a, just like Tesla did the not a flamethrower, this is not a pressure, or this is not a gun. It's an airsoft rifle to begin with. That's what the same thing Tesla uses. And they did the same thing basically. For the flamethrower, they just have an air, uh, they have a gas tank up here with the cone up front here. I was gonna add the cone, but it would deter from this and it would be hard to put the different nozzles in and out. But awesome. Make your own. Buy this on Amazon. There's a link down below where I got the gun on Amazon. And then all the hardware, except for this, just any foam cannon or anything will fit on top. But pretty cool. Safety won't go on now, but it's always an automatic. It's always going to be in three round bursts. So hope you like it. Here's some shots of me building this. And uh, this thing came out awesome. The Brian Company. I make sure the safety's on. What I ended up getting was a nozzle, and we're gonna adapt this inside here and still be able to attach foam cannon and all the other fun stuff.
que là. Power.